Hello students, now come to the next question of this exercise 5.5. Next question says that find the prime factorization of each number by the factor tree method. Means we will try to find all the prime numbers, but we will draw this thing like a tree. Okay, see here. Now how we will do this one? So we'll show. Then we write here. 96. First, let us divide it by 2. Very simple, very simple. See, many of you are getting confused. You don't know division at all. First divide by first prime number. See, 2, 4 is 8. You will get 1 here and 6 here. Okay. Now 8 to the 16. Is it clear? So in this you will write. 2 into 1 is 48. Okay. Now again, 48 is there. Suppose you are still confused. You forget the table. You know how to divide. Now what you will do? Simply go again by 2. Smallest prime number. So 2 to the 4 you will get. And 2, 4 is 8 you will get. Okay. 24. Again, simply you will write like this. 2 into 24. In this way, you are going to make this structure. Here also, it's very small one now. Now 2 into 12, you know, it is 24. Now for 12, again you will go 2 into how much? 6. And for 6, you know, 2 into 3. So this is the factor 3. This 2, this 2, this 2, this 2, this 2, and this one 3. So what you will write? 96 equal to like this. 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. How many do? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 1, 3 is there. So in this way, you will show it, okay? Now, come to the next question, okay? <clears throat> next. Next is your uh, 27. 27. Okay. Now, let's start. 27. Again, you will try. Very simple. Don't get confused. Whenever you step, you start. With the smallest prime number, with 2. See, can we divide? Let's see. 2, 1, zero, 2. Okay, now 7 comes down here. Now 2, 3, just 6. We are getting remainder 1. So it's not possible. So we will move to the next prime number. The next prime number will be our 3. Okay. <coughs> okay. And we know that by 3, it is 3, 9, 3. These are 27. So you got the value of 9. So simply what you will write? 3 into 9 and you know 9 3 into 3 so this 3 this 3 and this 3 and this 3 is 9 and 9 is 27 so 27 you can write like this now 3 into 3 into 3 so this is the factor 3 for 27 is that clear now go to the next one 51 next one is our 51 okay 51 again don't get don't get confused see <coughs> Whenever you see uh, an odd number in the unit digit, but one's place, so it is not possible to divide it by two. Okay, very simple. I want to say that whenever you are getting a odd number in the one's place, then that number will not be divisible by two. So you have to move to the next prime number. So you will go to the next prime number is what three. Very simple, we will write 51, again divided by 3, see, 3, 1, ja, 3, 3, 2, ja, 6, it will exceed the value, so we will go 3, 1, ja, 3, now 2, 1, 3, 7, ja, 21, the like here, so 0 here, so we will write like this, 51, na? so 51, 3 into 17, okay, now 17, 17 itself is a prime number, so only these two numbers we have 3 into 17. Is that clear? So you will write 51 equal to 3 into 17. Is that clear? I hope you understood this part. Now, come to the few more questions. Uh, 72. Four number, 72. Let's do it. Big number, you are confused, don't worry, simply divide it. See, now you can see an even number is there. Even number is there in the ones place, so it is easily divisible by 2. Whenever you will get even number in the ones place or 0 in the ones place, then that number will be divisible by 2. Don't worry, okay? Now, 2, 3, just 6 we are getting. So 1 and 2 will come down here. 2, 6, just 12. 
So 36, then this will be 2 into 36. Now again 36, so simply divided by 36. See, even number is there. As long as even number will be there, you just continue with dividing by 2. 2, 1, 2, then 1, 6, 2, 8, 16. So 2 into 18. Again 2 into 2, 9, 18. Again 3, 3, then 9. See here. 2, 2, 2, and 3, 3. So you will write like this. 72 equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 3. So, <coughs> so you got the idea about this one. Huh? Now one last more question. Let me do this one. This one is here. Click on 62. Okay. Let's try on 62. Okay, for few students, again a big value for few students. So what you will do is don't worry, simply again start dividing. Okay. See here, 2 is the even number. So again you will divide by 2. 2, 3, ja, 6. Now 2 come here. 2, 1, ja, 2. Okay, so 31. So what you will do? 62 in this way. 2 into 31. Uh, see. <coughs> 31, 31 itself is a what? A prime number because it is not the multiple of any number. See, in table of 2 you will not get 31. In table of 3 also you will not get 31. In table of 5 also you are not getting 31. In table of 7 also you are not getting 31. So ultimately what is a prime number? Is that clear? So this will answer 2 into 31. Very simple. I hope you understood this part and I think you can do the rest of the question whatever comes in the examination and you can do it. Thank you.